whatever the reason the syrian government is struggling and iran is proving its value in the war effort it is not the only active front line isil remains a threat in central syria the major problem that are facing in eastern eastern front such as eastern homes such as their resort and even the way but i'm, I'm going to talk about the desert only the eastern homes uh, basically every two days i'm not going to say daily there is an isis attack on a regime position causing the death of 10 to 15 civil, uh, 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 fighters among the regime Syrian President Bashar al-Assad has restored control over more than 60% of the country, but his army is exhausted, overstretched, and it seems too weak to recapture remaining rebel-held areas without the help of Iranian-backed militias. Many of the fighters on the front line uh, fighting on behalf of the regime have been recruited forcefully from towns across Syria. They do not actually want to serve. Many of them do not like the Assad regime. Uh, some of them have even fought against it uh, in rebel ranks, and therefore their morale, their determination to continue fighting is very low. Assad repeatedly says he will reconquer Idlib, but the battle for the opposition's last stronghold is proving to be difficult. Zanakhudr al-Jazeera, Beirut.